Hey DCS Bird fans, this is Peter from YaVR and today I'm trying the YaTube Motion Simulator in VR with the DCS Bird game. Um, I'm flying with an MIG-29 aircraft which is uh, which looks quite amazing actually in VR. I, I have high resolution and like high graphics everywhere so it has to be amazing but yeah it, it just shocked me how realistic it is. And I'm also trying the features of the motion simulator and some pitch movement for the first... Wow! Wow, man, this is amazing. So cool. I mean, does it look dangerous from outside? I mean, I guess. It's pretty cool. Now I just lost... Where did I come from? And the other... The other thing I, I really love about this one is that finally we managed to build a good and working solution for motion compensation and I don't feel sick when turning around. So that's the main point of motion compensation that you don't lose the, the center when you're rotating with the motion simulator, with any motion simulator by the way. And And yeah, the pitch movement again. I mean, I just, I just love this. Wow. Okay. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, I, I was about to tell that this feels realistic, but obviously I never did that in an MIG. Uh, I, I should. Well, I suppose it's more dangerous there, but yeah, it feels, feels quite good here in the motion sim and about motion compensation when I left off is uh, it's pretty good when I'm pulling it up uh, I'm not losing the display of my cockpit so I'm not moving out of the picture it stays in picture and even when I'm rotating it's the same and the other thing I really love like I think it's my favorite is shooting <laughs> It's so cool that the chair vibrates to shooting. I mean, yeah, here I cannot tell it's realistic or not. Obviously, I did not shoot ever with an MIG, but again, this is this feels very good. I mean, way better than playing on a desktop. You get the motion, you get the the vibration as as feedback, and yeah, it's just a whole different experience whole different experience like if I were playing with a different game I mean it's so cool I could play this all night and the motion range is like quite exceptional actually so the roll motion can be like uh, 20 degrees each side the pitch is 70 degrees altogether, so that's uh, about 55 and 15, so 55 backwards and uh, 15 front. It depends on where you calibrate the zero position, of course, but yeah, so 70 altogether. And for yaw motion, you could have 360. Uh, I'm just in a relatively small room, so that's why it's, it's I think the limit is set to about 40. And uh, what else? Like, it's also important to say that the power of the device is adjustable, and it's around 33 right now out of the 100. And as you can see, it's like it's behaving quite good. I mean, you can see that it moves me pretty well. Yeah, I'm I'm not heavy, but 36 or 35 for power is low, so it has still some way to go. And again, shooting, like, uh, that's also f can be calibrated freely, so I literally set it up for, for a hertz and the amp output for this button. And that's why it's doing this kind of shaky movement when I'm shooting. But you could have it differently, you can adjust any motion of the simulator, like, when I say any, I mean it. And also, like this same vibration can be set up or adjusted for the for just the engine itself. We have the inbuilt vibration, as you can see, and 
if I set it up to the engine, it feels quite good. Like I'm feeling it, it's well. But even even better if you add the back if you're adding a butt kicker. So that's that's obviously way better. I mean, uh, I don't have it installed on the device now. But if you install a butt kicker, which is not very hard to do, then then it's it adds a lot to the whole experience. Even now, it's very immersive. So I just, like, really, I'm just flying around for. I guess I'm gonna stay here by the end of the day. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wow, graphics are so cool. I mean, the cockpit is better than the than the forest and the surroundings, but that one is also impressive. Oh shit! Almost. So that's that's pretty amazing how you can do that. Okay, that was close. Yeah, I just love it. And you can look around. All the way anywhere. Yeah. It's so good. I guess what I'm doing is pretty dangerous in real life, but I would never do that. I, I don't even recommend doing it. But yeah. This is great, man. Do something else. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Okay, I, I guess I'm flying too dangerously because there's some alarm going on, and uh, I was about to faint a couple of minutes ago, a couple of seconds ago. Like I saw that the picture was changing to black. But really, there's no risk in this, I guess. It's a game. I think I'll end up in feigning <laughs> sooner or later. I'm really around the edge here. Oh shit. Something happened with the. I think my pilot. <laughs> I think I ruined my health right there. Whew. That was cool. I mean, thank you guys for watching. It was such an amazing experience. I really recommend trying this game in VR with these controls and of course with the Yachty Motion Simulator. It, it like, really, I cannot even compare it to the desktop mode I've been playing with previously. So, really give it a go. Cheers. <laughs>